This is a diagram <clears throat> I used in explaining the compensating diodes. And those diodes are in between the NPN and PNP transistor. And I will leave a link to that video in the show more of this one. And what I'm doing now is I got another question about why the input to the NPN and PNP transistors are at the bottom of the two diodes and not in the center. Well, it really doesn't matter that much, but I thought I'd... Uh, I had that question before, so I thought I'd go ahead and uh, set up an experiment here. And what I'm going to use is this. I'm going to have 20 volts across a 5K ohm resistor, and then two diodes, and then a 1K ohm resistor. And I'm going to put an oscilloscope right here. We'll do that as our output. And I'm going to put an input signal right here to start off with. That's where the signal is in that last uh, wiring diagram. And then I'm going to move it between the diodes. And then I'm going to move it right up here, right next to the oscilloscope, and we'll see what happens. Okay, here's the setup. Our 5K, two diodes, 1K, and of course the scope is right here at the top. And I don't have power on right now, but here's our signal that I'm going to use and I'm going to put that right here that's at the bottom where it shows in our wiring diagram now I'm going to turn the power on notice what happens okay these diodes are forward biased now so they're practically a wire Okay, now I'm going to move this up to the center. And it looks pretty close. I'm going to go back later and capture each one of these. I do it now, but it takes forever for this thing to capture the screen. So I'll do it later. And in this order. Now we're going to go up to where the oscilloscope is. And I'll capture that one also. So it uh, they're so close that this might as well be a wire. Let me turn off the power here. Notice that the signal is stronger that is because these two diodes are not conducting and this 1000 ohm resistor is not in the circuit and we turn the power back on okay center and at the bottom of the diodes. Now, these two diodes are not conducting, so we don't see anything. Here's the first capture with the input at the bottom 
And I'm going to leave the oscilloscope first capture right here so we can compare the other two. Here's the input between the diodes and on top is the capture for that and there's very little difference the rise is just a little bit more now I'm going to go to putting the input on the top where the oscilloscope is and you can see that the rise is just a little bit more 71 so Basically, when the diodes are forward biased, they're practically a wire. So it really doesn't matter where you have the input on this. And if you want to know what the compensating diodes do for the circuit, I've got a link to that video in the show more. Thanks for watching.